Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, before I even get started today, I know you probably already saw, saw the title of what the video is going to be, but stop what you're doing. Subscribe, please. I'm trying to get these coins and I'm trying to grow the following. So please stop and subscribe. Um, so without further ado, I wanted to take you guys through some of my everyday products. Now these are not beauty products, um, but there are things that I use on a daily basis or take on a daily basis. Um, so I kind of wanted to show you guys. Um, some of them I have an explanation for and some of them I don't. I've been doing it for years and, you know, your grandma tells you to do stuff and you just do it and now it's just like a routine. Um, but yeah, so first I'll start with my favorite facial cleanser. Um, I use this every day and a lot of people say it's too harsh for their skin. Um, this is Clean and Clear's Morning Burst. Um, a lot of people say it's too rough and it dries their skin out. I have extremely oily skin, um, so it's not bad for me at all. Um, I use this, I wash my face, and then I put cocoa butter on it. This is for every day that I'm not wearing makeup. So, <laughs> so this is my favorite lotion. It's like empty now, but I like have cases of it in my cabinet. Um, you guys always comment my pictures like, what type of lotion do you have on and why is your skin glistening? Um, this is why. This is the freaking absolute best lotion on the planet. Like, if you guys haven't tried, so they have two kinds. They have one with a white lid and one with the blue lid. Get the one with the blue lid because it's like super extra dry skin. And when I tell you it makes you glow, it's like unreal. So this is my favorite lotion. Um try it out because you guys always comment asking what has my skin like glistening in the sun and this is it um i use dove soap so i love the cucumber one um but i also of course use the white as well um the scentless but this is my favorite soap um, i have bars of it in liquid and um liquid and bar form uh also, on the hair tip, cannot live without this. Favorite Argan Oil. Um, I've tried a new Pantene brand, um, which was actually almost just as good, but this is just Old Faithful, so I use it all the time. Not every day, but I use it all the time. Um, along with that, so, oh, Vaseline. A lot of people think I'm like crazy for always having like loads of this, but I feel like you can't really go wrong. Like when your lotion isn't strong enough and I have really crusty feet. So when it's not strong enough and when you have to just regroup and come back and put Vaseline and some socks on to like get them back together. Can't really go wrong with it. I also use it for lip balm, feet and lip balm or whatever else you can come up with. Um, now onto my vitamins. Okay, so ladies, we have a lot of issues. And in order to keep stuff on track, you've got to take vitamins. Um, the ones that I take every day faithfully, um, I have here. And when I say every day faithfully, I mean some I take twice a day. And like if I go a day without taking it, I feel like my entire life is off balance. I don't know if you guys ever saw Sex in the City where um, Samantha went to Dubai and they wouldn't let her travel with her uh her vitamins and she was like super homo ho hormonal and weird the whole time that is me like i cannot go anywhere without like i have travel ones and i have ones that i leave in the house um so iron is one garlic so garlic is the thing that my grandma like you can tell her your tooth fell out and she would tell you to take garlic like garlic cures anything for her um, and I have really bad allergies, so it really helps me with that. But, um, yeah, I've been taking this since I was a kid, like garlic pills. And I take like six a day. So, yeah, garlic pills, they heal everything. Especially if you have like sinus problems and like all that stuff. Dry you right up. Um, vitamin C, of course, just because, I mean, everybody needs it. And I'm not really trying to drink orange juice because it's a lot of sugar. So I just take the pills. Um, turmeric, this is one of those ones where I don't really have an explanation, but a lot of people say do it, and then my grandma made me get it. Um, I kept getting colds and, uh, like sinus infections and stuff, and my grandma made me get it, so I've been taking it regularly to help with that. 
Um, fish oil, another one my grandma said get. Um, she said it pretty much just helps with everything. Um, these are just like regular multivitamins. And when I posted on Instagram asking you guys what vitamins to get, I had a lot of people telling me don't get a multivitamin, get each individual thing separately um, because the multivitamins aren't enough. So that's what I did was with, went and get got all of the um, vitamins separate. I take probiotic gummies. Um, so this is really personal. But ever since I was a kid, I've been like, my pH level has been off. Um, so like when I was like going through puberty and stuff as a kid, like I had like sweating problems and like it was just really gross. Um, but my pH balance has always been off. So, um, and now that I'm older, you know, as a woman, when that happens, it's not okay. So I take these gummies. They've been helping a lot. Um, these are nature's bounty. Um, if you guys have any other brands that are really good, I know a lot of people have like different ones that they've tried and liked. Let me know. I'm new on the probiotic thing. So... Um, I'm open to trying out new ones, but these ones have been fine, I guess. Um, I've been having less issues like I used to, so um, definitely better. Um, of course, I keep the emergency as well. We all know the weather has been, like, ridiculous in everybody's city state. Um, so it helps with the up and downness and making sure I don't get sick. Um, my immune system is a little bit stupid, so I just be sure to take everything, like, when I just before I even need it um and then smooth move it's smooth move best tea ever whenever you eat too much and you need to regroup get it